Hey everyone, in this video I want to talk to you about my favorite unanticipated side effect from having worked out consistently for almost four years in a row now. This was something that I didn't quite realize would end up happening, even though in hindsight it makes some sense, but it wasn't the reason why I started working out, so it's a good unanticipated side effect of it. And what I mean is gaining more respect from other people. And I more so mean people you don't already know, although you will gain more respect from them as well. But I just mean gaining respect from strangers for the most part, because it's something new to me. I'll be honest, when I grew up, I was one of the smaller kids, like basically my whole life for the most part. Like in elementary school, I was somewhat around the same height as all my peers. But then once middle school came around, they all significantly grew and I didn't. I was probably like, not even five feet tall in middle school okay maybe i got to around five feet in like eighth grade but i was really short so i did not gain any respect from any of my peers because usually kids are going to respect the other kids who are big and strong and whatnot because they know they're not easy targets and everyone's insecure at that age so they're not going to pick with someone who's going to be difficult to mess with so they go for whoever seems easy to mess with those people who are also insecure and unwilling to, or not unwilling, but more so unable to really defend themselves in any significant way. And that was me. I was really short and also really thin. I've never been overweight my whole life. I've always been really active doing random stuff. Like in elementary school, I would play a lot of different sports with, or during recess with my peers. In middle school, I skateboarded a lot. So I've always been active in high school. I played football. So I've, I've never been big, but for most of my young life, I was paper thin. Like I was active, yeah, but I wasn't doing anything to put on muscle. So I just never really gained weight, which was good and bad. Being paper thin meant that nobody was afraid of me. So yeah, I got made fun of rather often. I got picked on occasionally. I was even emotionally bullied, but eh, that's neither here nor there. The whole reason I'm bringing that up though is to give you a foundation for why I love the respect that I've gained now that I've been working out consistently for a while and put on some muscle because it's something I've never experienced my whole life up until recently. I've never experienced it. Nobody has ever really respected me before they knew me and got to know what made me a respectful person, like my integrity and the knowledge I have and my willingness to help other people and things like that. But before people would get to know me, nobody was going to respect me for any real reason unless they were a good person and naturally respected everyone around them, which is something I wish more people would do. But again, you've got to be a good person to do that. And yeah, many people don't seem to be raised to be good anymore, at least not in... Yeah, the people just need more basic manners is really what it comes down to. Like etiquette probably isn't really taught anymore and the world needs more of that. But the whole reason I want to talk about this is because it's just something that I've realized is beneficial and there are probably a lot of other people out there who grew up in similar situations to me where they were bullied, they were made fun of, they weren't used to being respected because they were smaller or thin or God knows what other reason, right? Kids can be rather vicious and cruel. So when you work out and you start taking your physical fitness more seriously and you start becoming more or in better shape over time. I want to say putting on muscle, but this, I don't think it applies only to men. I imagine women will get more respect as well the more fit they get, although they're not going to get as big as men get, so it'll be a different kind of fit. But I wager people tend to respect those who are adequately athletic because there's just something about that. It's, well, for one, you know, they'd be a more difficult target to mess with if you were trying to take advantage of them in some way, steal their belongings or whatever. God, yeah, there's even more morbid stuff because there are really messed up people out there and I, I don't want to pretend they don't exist because they certainly do. So the more fit you are, the more muscular you are, obviously you're going to be a less easy target for those types. So they're going to look at you and think, maybe I should avoid that person and instead go use that weaker looking person as my target today. So you will gain more respect from others for simply being a more difficult target because even though there are only a few people out there who would ever think of doing messed up things to people and seeking out those easier targets, we're all human beings at the end of the day. And it's kind of like 
you, when you see animals out there and it's like the biggest animal of course is going to gain the, more, the, the most respect from the other animals of that same species like the biggest lions will always have the most respect because they're big right <laughs> they're more difficult to mess with we human beings are animals as well that still applies to us to some extent psychologically if we look at someone who is very muscular and they're like an imposing figure we're probably going to respect them more because deep down there's that animal brain that we all are impacted by and we that animal side of us probably looks at them and goes okay that's someone i shouldn't mess with so <laughs> yeah it's just the respect that comes from someone being a more imposing figure out there and even if they're not actually like you know intimidating or anything they can come off that way before you get to know them and find out that they're a genuinely good and kind person to be around. But that first impression that people form of you will determine whether or not they respect you. So the more muscular you are, the more fit you are, you will probably gain more respect from people just flat out across the board. It's just the way it works and it's something I've experienced as well. And it's, it's nice for having never experienced it my whole life up until a few years ago. It's really cool because, yeah, it's just, it's something I never dealt with my whole life. And even growing up, it was funny, I had a lot of friends who were significantly taller than me. I'm talking like six foot and up, and they always were respected simply because of their height. Like, they weren't even muscular dudes themselves, but they're tall. You look up to them. So literally, there's that psychological thing where you're looking up at them. So, of course, you're probably going to respect them a bit more than you would someone you're looking down on just because there's that difference there. You're looking up at them. So yeah, it's uh, it's interesting, but this is something I think is beneficial for a lot of guys who grew up in the same situation where they weren't respected because they were small and that sort of thing or viewed as weak by their peers. And yeah, it's just, it's good for, for people to gain the self-confidence that comes from working out and just to get that feedback from the outside world from their respect of you gaining more respect i wouldn't say that should ever be the main reason why you work out obviously it wasn't the reason why i did it because i mean i didn't even think it would happen i, I don't know i mean if i had really thought about it, it probably would have made sense that this would happen just psychologically but i didn't think of it at all i just wanted to get in shape because i wanted to be stronger for myself and for my future wife and children i wanted to be able to protect them and that sort of thing and I thought you know if I'm really small and weak that's not doing them any favors nor is it doing myself any favors so I want to get strong enough to protect them and part of that is being a more imposing figure so that people will be less likely to mess with you when they see you out and about and whoever you're with because they probably aren't going to want to mess with someone they think could be difficult to uh, to overtake and that sort of thing so yeah, just uh, wanted to share my thoughts on this. I don't know, I found it interesting myself. Maybe you do too, maybe you don't, but hopefully it can at least serve as some motivation for developing healthier habits yourself and just becoming more athletic because if you're not used to it, I mean, it's, it's just cool to actually gain respect from strangers, to not be messed with, to not have people look down on you and other things. And it's kind of, it really is annoying how that's not the default for most people. Well, maybe it is, but I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it should be, but uh, maybe it's just my experience living in a big city. But yeah, people are just so different here. That they're, they're all about like themselves and how they can benefit from their actions. And other people are almost viewed as like obstacles when they're going about their day. So it's just nice to not have, well, basically for people to second guess being an a-hole around me, being rude and whatnot. Like, People are way, people, nobody's cut me in line since I've gotten bigger. So that's great. Whereas when I was smaller, it happened a few times. So there you go. Just things like that. It's nice to get respect from strangers so they don't mess with you and they respect you for once. So yeah. But anyway, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully you found it interesting. A bit of a psychological one, but also just some little experience here and some background in my life. Although if you've been following me for a while, you probably are familiar with the way I grew up, and yeah, so, anyway, hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Arrivederci!